Forgive me, brother. That's quite enough fish for tonight. I shall be on my way. That one had to be at least three feet in length. You are the ugliest fish I've ever laid eyes on. What is your purpose for bringing your repulsive body in my pond? Well, I didn't know it was your pond. You should. I am the god of this entire river and where all the fresh water flows. As such, I must purify the land of all demonic mutation. You seem to have been hit the hardest. I've never seen a fish as hideous as yourself before in all my existence. Well, I'm not a fish. My name is Jeb, and I'm a polywog. It isn't so. It is so, and I don't appreciate you talking to me in such a condescending manner. You mean to say that you are in fact the rare delicacy of the heavens in which the gods have been searching for since the dawn of time? I don't know what delicacy means, but gods must not have been searching for long. I mean, I was just born four days ago in this strange place. I was all alone, with nothing, but then a voice called me, telling me who I was. The judgment of Nicodemus. Nicodemus? Silence! You are not worthy to speak his name. Nicodemus is the creator of all Aelita. Hearing his judgment can only mean... You are indeed a polywog. Well, yeah. I mean, that's what I've been trying to tell you this entire time. Which means, if I can consume this polywog, I will be granted Nicodemus' fifth judgment. With that power, I... <clears throat> Please do pardon my rudeness. Jib, was it? You can call me Voice. I would be very much obliged if you accept my apology and join me for dinner. It's the least I can do. Uh, are you sure? Absolutely. I'm making my specialty Pisces confetti swirls with artichoke. What do you say? Well, count me in! I've never eaten something like that before! Thank you so much! No, Jib. Thank you. Oh, what'd you say? Forgive me. I was only speaking to myself. This way, 